Hello, and welcome to Moscato and Tea. This is the show for all things beauty, business, and community with your host, Inez and Chiquita, keeping it raw, real, and unfiltered. Welcome back. Okay, so we're back. Part two, hot topics. Okay, yes. I calmed down a little bit. Did you? <laughs> Not really, but you See, know. See, <laughs> there you go. Well, we're about to fire it back up. Okay, let's fire it up. <clears throat> Let me <clears throat> clear my throat for that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> You're a straight up mess. Okay, let's talk about these, um, your friends. Here we go. <laughs> Why everybody got to be my friend? You know, I, I, that's you know your, I got no friends. That's your world. These celebrities, you know. Okay, what about it? What is happening with your friends, the Kardashians? First of all, let's get Mm -hmm. something straight. Okay. We're not friends. You sure? Yes, I'm positive. Second of all, karma's a bitch. (laughs) And why do you say that, Ines? Let's break it down. Okay, I... I'm going to break it down. Mm -hmm. And this is my, again, these are my opinions, people. Mm -hmm. This has nothing to do with anybody else. This is how I feel about the situation and Mm -hmm. what it is. All right. These girls, Mm -hmm. or should I say women? Well, Mm -hmm. girls, because women don't do, you know, when you're a true woman and you know about yourself and you, Mm -hmm. you write with yourself, you ain't going to do shit Mm -hmm. to hurt other people. And, and tells you, so these girls have a tendency of always dating men that, are taken. Okay? Okay. They steal men from other women. Regardless if however met whatever, somehow or another you have to know that there was somebody else involved in this scenario situation. Mm-hmm. Okay? What happens is now I don't condone I don't condone the cheating at all. Mm-hmm. Like you but here's the thing, if you know the man's a cheater, how you get the man is how you're going to keep the man. So if you get him and he's cheating, Mm -hmm. don't think you're not going to get cheated on. And I'm not saying that being cheated is the right thing or she deserves. Absolutely not. Don't get my words twisted. No woman or man ever deserves to be cheated on. Mm -hmm. What it shows is that if you're a cheater and you're getting cheated, that means the man or woman you chose Mm -hmm. was not right for you and is not the person for you. But we want what we want. That's true. And sometimes we think we're the we're the. what is it? We're the exception to the rule. Yeah. That is not true. We're not the exception to the rule. The exception to the rule would have been like, yo, nigga, you got a chick. Don't talk to me till you're divorced or you mm-hmm. don't. Then maybe then we can talk. Because You don't th- think that happened with her? Maybe, maybe not. Mm-hmm. Maybe, maybe not. But at the end of the day, the same way they're persecuting this girl, mm-hmm. Jordan, mm-hmm. is the same way they everybody kind of cheered her on when... Chloe was with Tristan and his woman was pregnant. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Nobody said, oh, you know, hey, hey, yeah. hey, 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 whatever. At the end of the day, they're prosecuting this girl, Jordan, mm-hmm. because it, BFFs, whatever. There is no friendship when it comes to men and it comes to being in whatever. Yeah. The same, you know, I bet, you know, the same shit that just happened to Chloe. Uh, Kylie did to Black China. Oh, okay. Black China and Kim were friends. Okay, Kylie ended up with who? Black oh. China's man, Tyga. Oh yeah, that's true. Okay, mm-hmm. three sixty so th- degrees. Th- 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 okay, th- and that's another thing. Y'all don't know other men and women. I would listen. You listen, okay? <laughs> so I'm just saying. So here we go, right? But nobody said shit. Everybody's like, oh, cute, cute, mm-hmm. cute, cute. Hey, 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 hey. Why? Yeah. Because it was them. They can do it, but don't do it to me. Yeah. You know, you we can, they can take it. They can dish it out, but they can't take it. Yeah. So now they're, everybody's crucifying this girl. But wait a minute. Hold up a second. Not too long ago, mm-hmm. Kylie did the same thing. Nobody said anything. or was like, yo, Kim, what mm-hmm. about your homie? Are you, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Nobody said shit. But now that it's. It's on the shoe is on the other foot. It's a problem. It's a major problem. And again, I'm not condoning the mm-hmm. cheating. I'm not condoning anything. This is and all alleged. She, yes, this is all alleged. And allegedly, they're all yeah. doing all of this. And at the end of the day, the, the girl's 21. Mm-hmm. He's 27. Yeah. She's 34. Yeah. He's young. He's, he's, he's young. Money. Of course. There, of course. Life. This he's going to do what he, you know. I don't know. I don't know. 
you want a 27 year old guy who already mm-hmm. was ha- left his pregnant chick, the mm-hmm. first one, to be faithful and be with you and be a family man? You've mm. got to be out of your damn mind because mm. that's not going to happen because if that was the case, he would have done it with number one. Mm-mm. OK, then he would have done shit right, done bright, right, had her, had her baby, whatever he wanted to leave. Then mm-hmm. he would have done. But then he cheated on her already. Yeah. Now he did it again. Absolutely. What is he? He's telling her. He probably has been telling yeah. her. I, I also think it was all a thing about wanting to be known more. You know, he's yes, he plays. Mm-hmm. Basketball, but he's not on the level. Yeah, let's keep it one hundred. Of a Kobe of a or a Cur- LeBron. A Cur- LeBron. Yeah. He's not on that level. So what happens? You get with a Kardashian. You become on that level on a social media entertainment platform. Mm-hmm. I just want people to get tested, have Girl. safe sex, cause it's too much. So at the end of the day, I said karma's a bitch because you have to. You also have to understand that how you do other women, mm-hmm. it's going to. You, you have to pay back all of that. Yeah. You, it, it, there's just no way it, it happens one way or another. Unfortunately, she just, it, it, it some people it happens sooner than later. That's, you know, she knew what she was getting into. Mm-hmm. She knew well, already one when he cheated on her, when she was pregnant, right about to give birth. I was like, Ooh, that's kind of, she gave him another chance. Hey, at the end of the day, you can't be mad. It's the same way. Excuse me. With the whole Cardi B and offset shit. Yeah. She took him back. Okay, sister, yeah. don't be mad when he does that shit again. That's true. Because a leopard doesn't change his spots ever. That's true. What he can do mm-hmm. and what he will do when he wants to is calm the fuck down and not do it yeah. anymore. Just but at the end of the day, up. there's still that, you know, that whole thing about can you be tr- can you be trusted? Can mm-hmm. you trust what's going on at the end? And, and really, honestly, mm-hmm. we don't know. Like my mom, there's a saying in Spanish. Um, Nadie sabe lo que está en la olla, me lo que lo menea. So nobody mm-hmm. knows what's going on in that pot except the people who are stirring that pot. That's true. OK, so we could uh, from outsiders, we could say all kinds of things, blah, 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 blah. But in the reality, only Chloe, mm-hmm. Tristan and Jordan know what the fuck was really going yeah. on in, up in that part and that pot. And it's as, a, and it goes back to that mentality of the mob. Media, and maybe how they pounced on it too. And, and pounced on it, too. And maybe, you know, people are like, oh, this Cl- Kylie gave this girl all of this. No, yeah. this girl is her own human being and mm-hmm. her own shit. Like she might just because she knew her doesn't mean mm-hmm. that she didn't work hard for what she had. That's you know true. what I'm saying? She was a, she's a model. Sure. She got hooked mm-hmm. up, whatever. But she had to work somewhere. Mm-hmm. Yes. It just so happened. Maybe they met. They became best friends. And she just here's the difference. This is why people are saying, is it because people are saying because Kylie's white, now she gave this little black girl her opportunity? Ooh. Let's keep it 100 because that's the way I'm taking it. Mm. They're not saying, oh, Jordan was, if if if, if uh, Jordan was a white girl, would they mm-hmm. be still saying, oh, well, she did this, this, and this for her? And you think about that. Uh, the, and why are everybody coming down on her because it was a black girl? Yeah. But when Tristan and Kanye, all these guys are went with them that they're white girls, there was no kind of, it was kind of like a mm-hmm. big up, hey, yo, my brother, you do, you, you, yeah. you're rising up. And now did he, now did he go to the gutter because she was a black girl? And how they're treating her? That's where my problem mm-hmm. is. No, that's where see, I'm yeah. saying I'm not condoning what she did. Absolutely, it's wrong. I'm not condoning. But what? Why is it now that we want to drag? Yeah, like drag this little this 21 year old girl mm-hmm. who her best friend did the same motherfucking thing. So you hang with your friend, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but is it be uh, that's that's the million dollar question yeah. we need to ask? Is it because she's a black girl? Because I even saw a meme. Mm-hmm. So, you know, I hate the I hate social, social media. media. Social media, I hate the internet. But somebody put somebody wrote uh-huh. down <laughs> like, oh, Tristan got his Tristan got his black card back. Oh. He he uh, black he made Black History Month. He <laughs> dated he cheated on the white girl with the black girl. Like Y'all so he, rude. Rude, rude. <laughs> but then as I'm starting to see and what's mm-hmm. going on and doing all of this, I go, yo, they're dragging this chick. Yeah. Dragging her. And Kylie gave her this and Kylie did this and mm-hmm. well. It, is she uh, is she business savvy? Yeah, that Kylie would want to do business with her, or is she just giving her. They're making it seem like mm-hmm. this poor girl came begging, and Kylie's like, "Oh, here, yeah. baby, here's a handout." Is it because she's black? Let's keep you know at this point in day where real unfiltered, unfiltered in this day and age where everything is about that. I'm just saying, let's sit back and a- ask the questions. Yeah. 
That's true. And let's figure this out. Because now they're like, oh, they're deleting her. They're doing Mm -hmm. this. So am I? Okay. But at the end of the day, when, again, when Kylie was with Tyga Mm -hmm. and she was under a, nobody was in an uproar about none of that. That's true. Uh, Everybody was like, oh, that's so cute. That's so sweet. Uh, She wasn't even 18 yet. And she's dating some man Mm -hmm. in her 20s. Like, everybody was like, cute, 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 cute. And then she, her and her friends. So if, if I'm Jordan and I'm thinking, yo, you're my homie. You did it. We cool. Mm-hmm. Nothing. Why would I think otherwise? Yeah. Well, got to watch it play out. Hey, see what happens. And see what happens. The shade. I'm so scared. Real. So real. You know. Well, so think, next. <laughs> thinking about new music and everything. What do you have to say? Um, what have you been listening to lately? I know Ooh. Offset got a new album coming out. Hold up a second. Hold what? up. Breaking news. We're breaking news. Breaking news. What's beep, happening? Beep, beep. Breaking news. R. Kelly charged in Cook County with ag- aggravated criminal sexual abuse. Ooh, ooh. ooh, we were just talking about that Chicago Sun Times. Shade, the shade, girl, the Finally. shade. I was just thinking they're all mm. doing all this. So let's see what plays out with that breaking yes. news. We're we'll, gonna, we're we'll gonna have get some, some more, more on that one. Got to get some more info, girl. So we'll talk about that some more on uh, later uh, episode. episode. Yes, because that's some it, very it, piping hot tea right girl, there. Girl, I just burnt my tongue. <laughs> <laughs> Whew, I tasted that tea. I was like, wow, it's hot. <laughs> but one of the questions is why it takes so long. Mm. You know, that's another question. But you know, next. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, it's it. I don't know. I'm gonna keep quiet on it. But um, some new albums coming out. Offset, Kalani. Who else got some new music? Um, I'm trying to think, who else? I was like, I know Pink had a new um, record come out. She was just awarded at the Brit Awards. Oh, that's nice. Um, oh, so, speaking of speaking of which, wasn't Beyonce and Jay Z? Oh, they some, won an award. Yeah, yeah. and then. And then they were talking right in front of Meghan Markle's. Yes, I love uh, it. Uh, yeah, of course you would. Uh, right in front of Meghan Markle's uh, <laughs> portrait. Yeah, portrait. Oh, yeah. yeah, you know. Yeah, I'll I love it. it. Well, do you know they uh, talked about uh, Meghan Markle because she had her baby shower here in New yes. York, and supposedly it cost two hundred thousand dollars. Yeah, and so they went in on her. Well, first of all, she could do whatever the fuck she wants to exactly. do. She's a princess. Second of all, exactly. is it a problem? She is American people. Yeah. So she took her American tradition mm-hmm. and with her. Her close friends and family who probably want to be like, yo, we want to throw mm-hmm. you a baby shower. Yep. And she's like, oh, you know, it's not so what. Hey, you know what? Yeah. What is it? They want to give the baby gifts. Let them give the baby gifts. Exactly. If it's not part of the. It the ain't Briti- your money. Yeah. And it ain't part of the British, you know, thing. Yeah. That's the whatever. Yes. She has given up a lot. Let her have mm-hmm. some fun with her friends. It's her and, first child. And have celebrate her baby shower. Like, yeah. Bye. Y'all need to sit down and leave her alone. Like at the end of the day, she's a princess. You mm-hmm. know, we all are, we all want to be a princess. Let yep. her live that lifestyle. That's hers. Mm-hmm. And if her husband ain't saying shit, who are we to say anything? That's true. That's all I'm saying. Yeah. It, it, again, <laughs> is it a problem? Listen, let me not go there. <laughs> But anyways, let her you live her on fire today. <laughs> let her live her life. I yeah, know, I that's thought the it was problem cute. right now. Where everybody is in everybody's business. Yeah, she was so cute. She looked so yep. pretty. She came to New York. She wanted to mm-hmm. see her friends. She's given up a lot to be with mm-hmm. this man. And she nope. does a lot for other people. Yes, and absolutely, and charities and everything. So what? She wants to go hang with her friends. Mm-hmm. We got forty five sitting there spending. B- a national emergency on a stupid damn wall and we're yeah. going to criticize some young lady whose friends want to throw her a baby shower? Bye. Priorities. Yes. They don't know. Bye. Yeah. They're, they're, it's all I twisted. hope she had a good time and I hope she got really cute gifts. <laughs> I mean, for $200,000, she better have. Listen, that's a peanut. That's like us spending a couple hundred on a uh, on a that's baby true. shower for your friend. That's true. You know, she like uh, 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 a ma. Uh, what's her? She had Priyanka was there. Mm-hmm. All her, all, uh, Serena, Serena, all her best friends were there. Mm-hmm. The same ones that went to the wedding. Exactly. So it, it ain't like she got a new group of friends and then her friends on the side talking about what happened. Mm-hmm. Like on Insecure, but you know, <laughs> I'm, I'm just dying for the show to come back. Yeah, I but, know, you know. I know. But anyways, leave that child alone. <laughs> Well, that kind of uh, also with um, Insecure, the actress on there. Uh, what's her name? Amanda Seals. Yes, I follow her. She is. Amazing. Well, she had a little controversy. She's always got it. She talked she, about the Jesse Smollett thing, but she brought it back to it being black men and mm-hmm. they're the issue and the reason um, for you know all what? this trouble, supposedly. You know, I and can't be mad at her. her. 
I can't be mm-hmm. mad at her because she speaks her truth. Mm-hmm. And that's how she feels. And at the end of the day, a lot of the time, she, some of the shit she says makes sense. Other times, I just have mm-hmm. to laugh because I got to giggle out of it. But are people mad because what she's saying makes sense? They are saying that the problem with her, supposedly, she's always downing black men. Mm-hmm. I've never seen, like, besides on Insecure, I've never seen uh, any of her comedy shows no, or things that she's talked about. But supposedly, um, I, they say she's always downing, you know. Mm, well, I mean, how many comedian black uh, black comedians downgrade black women twenty four seven? I'm just I'm just saying, keeping it real. Uh, I mean, how many black black comedians talk bad about black women? Uh, so now it's a problem mm-hmm. because a woman is doing it. Again, they could take it, but they can't. They they mm-hmm. could dish, dish it out, out yep. but they can't take it. Exactly. So I mean, if that's how she feels, that's how she feels. Yeah. I'm not saying I'm not saying it's right or wrong, but mm-hmm. you know, all of a sudden now, uh, black men. Uh, <laughs> Listen, mm-hmm. now all of a sudden black men want to get in their in their uh, in their feelings. Mm-hmm. How about sticking up for the black woman? Maybe you won't so be so much in your fucking feelings. How about that? Uh, that's all I'm saying. Mm-mm. Get and, it. What, what, what else? I mean, you know, uh, let's I'm, there's a lot more that goes deeper into this. But, mm-hmm. you know, that's true. Well, kind of uh, one thing, I don't know if you've seen the um, (laughs) CEO or president of the Time's Up movement. She stepped down, resigned, supposedly for take care of family, you know, situation. Mm -hmm. Well, come to find out, allegedly, Mm -hmm. her son has been accused of sexual assault. It was in L.A. Times. What do you think about that? That's a problem. Do you think... You could still work in the organization knowing that's happening. No. no. And she did the right thing by stepping down. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. Uh, there's no way. Mm-hmm. There's no way because now and not, not only that, that's her son. Mm-hmm. So now she's in a time where now she's conflicted. Mm-hmm. She believes in the movement because she started that movement and she yep. does believe in it. But now she got a she got a son who now is being accused. Now, what is she? Is she mm-hmm. is she going to be a mother or is she going to be an activist? That's true. So by by all means, step down, mm-hmm. take care of your biz, and you could still whatever. Mm-hmm. But you got you got you got business to handle. Yeah. And now you have to look at yourself and your son and sit there and saying, "I'm preaching all of this. Where did mm-hmm. I go? Where did I go wrong in all of this? And what made him think that it's okay? Mm-hmm. Especially me knowing, knowing this. She, where she? What right. she does? And again. Anyone? We don't know. Yeah. Alleged. Uh, they're, they're alleged. Don't know. I don't know if accusations, the accusations were just saying, but I think it's a good, I think she did the right thing. Mm-hmm. It's better that she stepped down than they, they, they kick her out. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Because that, that's what I'm saying. A lot of these people, they want to fight. Just step your ass down. Mm-hmm. Step it down. Go to the side. Yeah. And if it turns out that it's not, it's all then you could come back and say, yo, mm-hmm. I did it because of this, but I'm back. Or you could start another movement and keep it pushing. Yeah. Keep it going. Mm-mm. Cray, cray, cray. So, you know, we've come to the close of Hot Topics, this two-part episode. And so I'm just going to leave you with this. Coming up soon, they're going to be airing the MJ documentary. So get ready. Okay. We're going to watch it. We're going to do like a live okay. watch. I know it's conflicting. Yes, it's but, very conflicting for me. But, but I think it'll be good, okay. you know, and stuff like that. And we could talk about it here on the okay. show. Okay. Um, so stay tuned for that. And once again, lady. It's been wonderful. Always. Another recording. Another, another day. recording. Another day. Another yes. dollar. They're, look at making Blue a mess. And making a mess. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for listening, guys. We appreciate it. it. Bye. Bye. Thanks for listening. Take a little time to enjoy your brand of Moscato and tea with us every day. Subscribe, rate, and follow us on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and MoscatoandTea.com.